Hello everyone, this is Mr. Appel, and if you're stuck on this problem, you came to the right place. So, uh, we have a rhombus. Uh, first thing you need to be able to do to, to do this problem is remember what you know about a rhombus, and also, you know, the properties of a rhombus and all kinds of good stuff. Uh, so first of all, they're talking about the diagonals of the rhombus, so that's referring to the diagonals going from one corner to the other corner. So those are the two diagonals. And now if this diagonal here, that looks like the longer one, so we'll have that be our 30. So if that's 30, and this one is 16, diagonals bisect each other in a rhombus. And so that means that this is 15, and this is 15. And if that's 16, they're gonna be eight and eight. So that's the first thing, and that's only because it's a rhombus and the diagonals bisect each other. The other thing that we know about a rhombus is that the diagonals are perpendicular. So they make right angles in the middle. And so what we see here is you actually have four right triangles inside that rhombus, and they all have the same side lengths. They're eight by 15. The two legs are eight and 15. So all four of those triangles are congruent to each other. Um, so to find the perimeter of the rhombus, we just need to find the length of one of those sides and then multiply that by four because all four of those are the same. So let's pick one of those right triangles. Let's just say we focus on this one here. So we have a right triangle and we know two of the three sides and so we can simply find the third using the Pythagorean theorem. So the legs are 8 and 15, the hypotenuse is our x. So 8 squared plus 15 squared equals x squared. And so that's 64 plus 225, which is x squared. And add those together and we get 289, which is x squared. And then if we take the square root of both sides, we're left with the square root of 289, which is exactly 17. And so each side is 17, but that's not what it asked for. It asked for the perimeter. So if each side is 17, whoops, each side is 17, uh, then the perimeter is 17 times 4, uh, which is, what is that, 38. And that is that. Hope this was helpful. Thanks.